humans share. That's, that's the way we're built, or at least over time, that's the way our brains have become programmed to operate. Let me tell you a story. Imagine it's 10,000 years ago, and I'm part of this semi-related, semi-nomadic tribe that roams up and down the shores of this unnamed lake. Once in a while, the hunting is good, and I bring back more food than I can possibly eat. Now I have two choices. I can try and hide it and keep it for myself, or I can share it with the rest of the community. Now if I keep it to myself, I'll be well fed for a few days, but then it'll probably go bad and just be wasted. And, and if the rest of the tribe discovers my secret, I could be in big trouble. But if I, if I share it, kind of like a potlatch, uh, the whole tribe would be well fed. Yeah, for a shorter time, but, but I'd be welcomed, I'd be congratulated. Maybe I'd even become more attractive as a potential mate. So from a genetic perspective, over time, the, the people that share are the ones that are still around. 